people will probably think, wow, what, what, why am I here? Why am I supporting Christina? Is this just gonna be like, or, or, or people here? Is this like gonna be this workshop that just rags on, on rich people, right? Because that's what we yes. think of activists, right? Like people just rag on rich people all day. And um, I actually, I love rich people. Let's give up for rich people. <laughs> Someone was checking out your fixed geared bicycle outside. I think they're going to steal it. <laughs> I heard some space is open at the shelter. Ma'am, um, the gardener is sleeping with your daughter. Son of a bitch. Continue. <laughs> Where do we go now? Where do 
I don't know where Maybe you're going, Bahamas. but I'm going to Florida. The chair game. to write my own ballad, you'd be surprised to know I'm multi-talent. It's Mother's Day. I haven't seen my child in a while. What more can I say? Please pray. I'm so rattled. The ills of my body are a day-to-day -day battle. Before all this strife, I once had a life. I once had hopes and dreams before my world turned upside down. Now my words sometimes come out in a scream. My thoughts are sometimes so jumbled. This causes me at times to fumble, to mumble. Ugh, I can get so frustrated. This life sometimes seems so overrated. I hate it. Don't ask me. Sure, I've contemplated. Lord, please help me to hold on to my dream. Because right now, it's all I have, at least so it seems.
community. And um, so I, I'm, <laughs> I was really uh, disappointed that I didn't get to see this person uh, in the workshop. I seemed interested, but I'm glad he's here today. Uh, he has a really funny name, but he's very revolutionary, and he's going to speak from the heart. And I, I, I love this. I love him, and I love his name. His name is Brother Pancake. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> and he's going to be singing from the heart. Of the Give yourselves a hand. Clap for everybody in the house. Welcome to the LA Can Playhouse. Good to see you, Pastor Q. Love you folks. You know, from the heart, first of all, I'd just like to um, welcome everyone. Thank you for being here. <clears throat> Taking time out from your busy schedule. And a happy Mother's Day. Okay, and um, just from the heart here, you know, um, when was the last time you laughed? Oh, <laughs> oh <laughs> laughter. I read somewhere that laughter is like medicine. Laughter is healing. That one word I read before that, is anybody married? Or singing. You know, there's a lot of healing in that. You know, just a little song. It says, <coughs> everybody sure you feel You're going to sing along, okay? <laughs> Don't say you can't sing. Singing, mm -hmm. singing, singing, melody. Mm -hmm. Melody in your heart. No man pride. No sir. Three minutes, right? Miss Long? When there's one door closed, another time. door is open, girl. Time. Okay? You leave that past the cute. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Amen. Say amen. We're not having church, but you know. Hey, come on, somebody. Uh, mm -hmm. Who was that that said that? Who was that? I, I heard something out there. Who was that? Uh, who made, a, who made a sound out there? Uh, who made a sound? Anybody that made a sound out there? How many sounds can you make? What is the sound? Not necessarily noise, huh? Make a sound. Mm. Woo! <laughs> now make some noise! Let's hey. yeah. make some noise again. Are you too loud? I'm not too loud, am I? Be quiet. All you gotta do is this. Sometimes I learn one thing. Sometimes you don't have to change, just make adjustments. Just a little louder. Reach out and touch. Let's sing along. Somebody's hand make this world a better place. If you can, come on, everybody. Reach out and touch. Reach out and touch. Make this world a better, 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 better. Give yourself a hand clap. Do you have siblings named Brother um, Easy Over Eggs? Well, you brother know the crepes, you know, pancake <laughs> Brazil. <laughs> Been the more than one country, you know. Brother Jam and Toast. Yeah, that, you got it, girl. <laughs> Good. Awesome. Thank you for that. <laughs> I hope when you ask that question, when's the last time you laughed, everyone said a few minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs>
ever wanted to tell someone to eat shit? Well, now you can. <laughs> Introducing the poop, the newest flavor from... Pr <laughs> the newest flavor from pretentious creamery. <laughs> <laughs> made from the poop of the extremely wealthy. <laughs>
find ways. It's not the best. Take your I think time. that sounds pretty good. <laughs> but listen to the words. It's really hard. <sighs> Each day I say that today won't feel like yesterday, but it stays this way today and every day. I pray that today will feel a different way, but it stays this way. I remain not a token of honesty that came too late. Here in the midst of madness, washed up by the tides of war, try to resist the sadness, but the pressure is hard to endure and wait. Here we begin again, still playing. And everyone's innocent, just victims of change. Wearing the mask of freedom, hiding behind a smile, playing the role of a leader, pretend for just a while. Everything seems an illusion, echoing around my brain. Try to a fast conclusion, but the images fall like rain. Can we begin again, still playing our game? And everyone's innocent, just victims. Of change, living in sin again with no one to blame, and everyone's innocent, just victims of change. Each day I say that today won't be like yesterday. But it stays this way today and every day. I pray that today will feel a different way. But it stays this way.
right black boy plays stupid. We were never meant to be this compliant, but white man said compliant. So black boy chugs a 40. White man says angry. Black boy says, yes, I am. Yes, we are. We were never meant to be this compliant. So black boy pours poetry over beatbox, calls himself thug, then dreams up ways to kill white man. But white man says, point the gun the other way. Black boy turns gun to himself, to his family to his people, pulls the trigger, pull the trigger, to his community, this community, our community. So now black bodies fill the streets and we never know if it's us or them. White man says, look at what you have done. To this city, to this community, black boy says, God damn it, why can't you see? Our fragile hearts are still hearts even if they are broken. We are still human, even if our skin mimics the nights of too much crying, knowing tonight might be our last. So we drink like it already was and hope for tomorrow we are still people, even if our people are treated a little bit more like animals. We are not who you say we are. E Wait, sorry. Even though you say we are, we were never meant to be this compliant in our own destruction, but we are resilient. And so this is either our last day as slaves or this is our last day as humans. But we already knew that every day is our last day as humans until it's not. And we wish it were. Because most of us are either kill or be killed. Either carrying the buckets of blood on our shoulders or that same blood is dripping from our hands. We were never meant to be this hate. You shoved down our throat but now we beat our children the same way you beat our ancestors. I wonder how much of this story will be metaphor. But before that, I wonder how much of this story will be fact. Or how many times my people will have to come back, have to come back until you understand that my people are not people. We are a little bit more God. I wonder how close to holy that our black women were when they saw the pre presence of God in their own children's eyes before they beat them to death because our gods do not deserve this much torture, this much hell. Do hell so we'll send him back until we can fight to kill the white man that gave us the gun but we will also have to fight to kill the black man who held the gun and did his own temple or the black man who sold us a dream of making it rich by working demolition in hell and we have seen hell enough times it's about time we reclaim our heaven that you white man cop politician yes. politicianer mr reagan that you one percent business owner that you two chain media maniacs, that you, Thomas Jefferson, Christopher Columbus, Rush Limbaugh, that you told us wasn't fair. Yes! She too was carried out of the court. I stood up to be heard and was politely instructed that the new three strikes law prohibited any leeway in five dollar crack cases if the defendant had two prior strikes. I insisted that the judge at least wait until we heard from groups such as the LA Can or the association with NAACP. Somebody we needed to have some help here to speak out. None I too was taken out of the court. All right, Dean. Thank you. Uh, okay, so we've had uh, the deacon now, 
I used to be. <laughs> Why, I, I prayed a little. And I've lost some hair. <laughs> but, but look at Michelle. Stand up, Michelle. Doesn't she look beautiful? Give her a hand. I say to her, baby, what's your secret? Do you know what she tells me? Fruits and vegetables, baby. Fruits and vegetables. <laughs> now that gets pretty damn annoying. <laughs> because as you know, I love my chicken. <laughs> now as your president, I've handled so many, and I make so many decisions in the course of my day, yet I'm still able to find time to pray at least Five times. <laughs> it's never easy now, but Joe Biden's shoulder massages, whoo! That's it, baby. <laughs> look, uh, it's been an exciting six years. <clears throat> a lot of ups, a lot of downs. So is my approval rating right now, but. Uh, <laughs> Not in Kenya! <laughs> oh, look, 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 look. I won't be the first to tell you people that I've made mistakes. Like uh, telling black people to pull themselves up by their own bootstraps. Now, you know that's impossible, because you land on your black ass! <laughs> and as for being your first black president, <clears throat> well, <clears throat> being blackish only makes you popular for so long. <laughs> you know, that thing has a shelf life. <laughs> Ask Fox News. <laughs> you can always count on them to scare white people. <laughs> Old white people. <laughs> so, in conclusion, I was, it was mentioned to me the other day, someone said, Mr. President, you in your last last years, do you have any wishes or any last things you'd like to do? Do you have a bucket list? And I'll tell them, I said, well, I have something that rhymes with bucket. <laughs> <laughs> Wanna hear? <laughs> For instance, 
taking executive action on immigration? <laughs> Bring back single payer? Fuck. <laughs> Fine and jail all our Wall Street bankers <laughs> who caused this country to go into debt? Fuck it. <laughs> Increase the Social Security and Medicare net so our older people and disabled will not have to live in poverty? Fuck it. <laughs> but seriously, folks, in closing, I'd like to acknowledge that Senator Bernie Sanders is running for president. <laughs> we have another pot smoking socialist in the White House. Who says that America is not ready for a third Obama term? Very, very, very. 
very big day for the firm. We have a brand new client, our biggest client. Who? In a long time. Wait for it. It's <laughs> an organization that's been under a lot of scrutiny lately. Yeah. And they're looking to rebrand, revitalize their image. We have to come up with a new name. Who is it? Who is it? For the LAPD. Oh, I can't take it anymore! <laughs> <laughs> Something new, something fresh. Uh, should now, ask later. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> yes. Is there a police box? Okay, we just simply uh, go back to a historical uh, representation, kind of like right now. We're in a time very similar to um, police state of other totalitarian regimes. So, how about the Gestapo? Maybe? <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I like it. Wait, I got it. How about uh, we just call it uh, the, the, the Pertinent Investigative Guys, or P-I-G. <laughs> hey! <Ooh. laughs> <laughs> Did I 
All right. We in this community because uh, <laughs> creativity is essential to social health cool. and it's a human right. Yes. Cool. Right. Yes. Go hard. So I'm Chella. I live and work here in this community and um, one thing about myself that I'm just going to say to make y'all laugh right now is I love me some Oreo cookie shake from Jack in the Box. Frankly <laughs> <laughs> from Jack in the Box. Not, not McDonald's but Jack in the Box. Uh, with the whipped cream and the cherry on top, y'all know what I'm <laughs> <laughs> That's what we're going to do. Hello, everyone. I'm Rich. I was one of the guest artists um, for this workshop series, and it was my pleasure to do it all. Thank you. I just want to thank Christina and Rich for bringing us all together.
everybody. Thank you for coming. My name is Matt Miyahara, and I'm really looking forward to eat, uh, sharing a meal with you. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I'd like to thank the Wine Guard, LA Can, uh, everyone who was involved in putting on the workshop, and you again. Thank you. Well, thank you. All right. Hi, my name is Wendy Gator. I would like to thank everyone for coming out here, including the cast that has been so wonderful. I, most of the people I just met, and they're wonderful. And I just want to ask everyone to keep in mind, and we must do it, let's make that change. Okay? Mm -hmm. Suzette Shaw, and I just wanted to um, take a moment and thank Christina, as well as Rich, for the opportunity. I'm sorry that um, I just had an opportunity to join the cast today, but it's, it's <laughs> such an honor and such a pleasure um, to be a part of um, part of this event. And I hope that uh, I have an opportunity to work with you all again another time. Blessings to everyone. All right. Happy birthday!